Hi, we are going to see how to design a sticker in TVS LP46 Neo by using Bartender software. This Bartender software, you can download it from TVS website and directly by searching on Google or else I have shared you the downloading link on the description. So before going to design part, first install the printer driver and Bartender software on your computer. I have already installed both. So after installing, you can able to see on your desktop, you will be getting a desktop icon like this, but under ultralight. I am just going to double click and run. So if you run, you will be getting a screen like this. So initially, it will show two options, blank template and but under existing but under document. So we are going to design a new, new sticker. So just click on blank template and click next. Now it will show multiple drivers. It is showing all multiple drivers. So in this particular bot under LP46 Neo, so I have selected 46 Neo BPLE. I'm just going to click next specific custom settings. Next. Here you can able to see items per page and heading itself. So if you are using single item per page, you need to select single item. Single item per page means in your uh, label role, one page will have only one sticker. Suppose if you are having two stickers in a row, you have to select this option and column as two, two and just click next. If you are having three columns, in a page three column stickers or four columns, so whatever the columns you are having, you can select. So I am going to select two for just sample design. I'm going to click next so this is the sample template format so I'm going to click next here you can able to see user defined size width is 4 inches and height is 6 inches um, I am going to design a sticker where the height is only 1 inches so I just have mentioned 1 inches and then I'm going to click next so you can able to see this is the sample design format so this is how your sticker will look like where label role stickers will be look like just click next and then again click next now you can able to see template size it is to 1.99 it means 2 inches height is 1 inches and then gap and pitch here horizontally if you want to mention any gap like uh, in here center if you want to mention any gap just mention 0 0.12 so you can able to see 0 0.12 means 3 mm center cap so here the space is appearing so if you want to mention horizontal gap just mention this size here so if you want to enable you need to click this set manually and then you can mention the size so here I don't have any gap so I'm just clicking next next and finish on designing part so now you can able to see white template appearing here so whatever the content you are designing so whatever the text you are mentioning here or barcode you are mentioning or whatever the design you are doing you have to do within this template so if you are doing whatever within this template it will get printed if it is going out of the box this box this white box then that will not appear in a printout so here we are going to see how what are all the options available in uh, Printing. If you want to add a line, you can select like this line. So, if you want to add any circle or any logo or any symbol, so any kind of options, you can add by using these shapes. If you want to add a text, just click here. If you want a single line, just click single line. If you want multi line, just click multi line. If you want to add any symbol, font characters like checkbox tick marks into mark so those kind of simple fonts you can use by using this simple font characters if you want to add a barcode you can use this click here you can able to see multiple barcode formats are showing there if you click more barcodes you can able to see what are all the barcodes available in the design so standard in normal shops and all everyone will be using this code 128 only most of the software integrators will be using this code in 128 only so I have selected on barcode for sample. If you want to edit the barcode or shrink or anything, 
see for example top to down you want to adjust so you can adjust like this by using your mouse cursor it's simple uh, it's like a normal word or excel so i'm just going to click okay so if i want to change the font i can change the font size or if i want to change the font type whatever i'm going to mention the arial the font style will be changed eight so it's like normal word you can change the font style as well as font size also so now i have added barcode if you want to add a text you can add text single single line so if company name whatever the company name company name and another text item name and then i'm going to add another text mrp this thousand so like this this is simple format which i have designed now so like this you can design whatever item name quantity was whatever the content you want to add so you can add just like this and then you can this is all about design so if you want to add a text just click here on this a single line multiple line like that you can add if you want to add a barcode you can add from here if you want to add a line just click here for example on company name below i want to make this headline so so i will adjust like this so it will look good so like that whatever the design you want to do within this template you can do and then after finishing this all design if you want to print just click ctrl p so i am going to mention two copies why i will tell you because we are using two column stickers so i am mentioning two copies if you are using three column sticker mention three copies so i am going to mention two copies here i am just going to see a preview now so this is the design so if you give print out so this content will print this print out will be coming there so if you want to change the content or if you want to add the text so to change the text you can able to see if you take the mouse cursor just like this you can able to see change the text if you want to change the barcode content just double click and come here 123456 i can mention a b c 1001 So whatever alpha numeric barcode or numeric barcodes, whatever the content you want, you can use and print it. That's all. After completion of your design, save in any folder. So wherever you want to save, you can just click save. The sample document I have shared on link also. that's all so here after if you want to use just open the design file just double click and open you can do it thank you